Hi, Ceci. Good evening. Hello, teacher. How are you? Hi. Ready. And you? Yes, ready. How was your day? Tell me. Everything was cool. Everything yeah. was good. Yes. More relaxed. I was working. Okay, from home, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. I get up early. Do you have a schedule to start to work? What? Do you have a schedule? Un horario. Do you have a schedule? Yes, uh, but every day is different. Oh, for example, today? What time did you uh, start to, to work? At 6 a.m. to no 3 p.m. Wow, very early. Yes, um, for example, well, yesterday uh, was the same. Okay. Special today, mm -hmm. but um, the, can remember the last... The day before uh, yesterday? Earlier today, today, for example, was uh, 2 mm -hmm. at, at 9 p.m. From 2 to 9 p.m., ah, okay. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. what about in your... In your... In, the, in, in your job, you have to show your face or it just like, it's not necessary to show the No, uh, only I'm a journalist, so I have the program to write. Yeah. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. ah. Different news or... Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay, I mm -hmm. understand. So you can be in pajamas with no makeup or... <laughs> yes. <laughs> ah, that's cool. Okay, that's cool. Uh, I take ah. a shower at... 3 p.m. <laughs> yeah, oh, that's mm -hmm. nice. <laughs> yeah. Okay, that's nice. Yeah. Well, that's pretty good. Very nice. Kari, hello, good evening. Haleita too, welcome to the class. Okay, we have three girls. Very punctual, huh? Very nice. Okay, we have three girls here. Okay, very nice. How was your, your, your day, Karina? Kari, are you there? Well, I think she's she's not there, okay? And Aleida is here too, okay? Well, girls, we're going to start the class for today. Okay, we have half class. We are going to practice, you know, superlatives. Yesterday we studied about superlatives. And uh, the rest of the time, we're going to study the last topic from the section number four, okay? Well, Hugo is here too, okay? Hi, Hugo. Welcome to the class. That's nice, okay? Well, this is uh, what, what I have for you today. I have um, a quiz, okay? This is a, a world knowledge quiz. This is the name, okay? World knowledge quiz, Okay, here I have different uh, questions, right? With different answers. So you're gonna work in pairs and you have to give me the right answer, okay? The, 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 the pair that has more answers correct is going to be the winner, okay? And you're gonna receive pollo campero tomorrow for lunch. That's nice. I have okay. 10, <laughs> 10 questions here, okay? For example, Hugo, can you help me to read the first five questions? Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, one. Mm -hmm. The number Which one. Which animal lives the longest? The longest, very good. Continue number two. Only read. Yes, only read. Mm -hmm. uh, which one is the tallest? The tallest. And you have three, three answers. An elephant, a giraffe, or a camel. Well, this is what you have to do with your partners, right? Choose the correct answer. Number three, please, Hugo. Okay. Mm -hmm. Which of these is the heaviest? Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, next, number four. Which planet is the smallest? The smallest, uh huh. Continue. Which planet is the largest? Okay, very good. Very nice. I like that. Can you continue reading number six, seven, eight, nine, ten? I am going to send you right now the questions to the WhatsApp group, okay? That's it. I like that number six. Which metal is the human? Uh huh. Very good. 
Number seven. Country. Which country is the driest? Driest. Uh huh. Very good. Driest. Eight. Which is which is closer to the equator? Equator. Mm -hmm. Uh, which place is the wettest? Wettest, uh huh. And yes. the number ten. Which ocean is the deepest? Deepest. deepest. Okay. What well, ocean is the most profound? Right, ocean. Remember. Okay. Very good. Thank you very much. Okay. Those are the questions, guys, that you have to answer. In your WhatsApp, okay, you have the picture, the questions, and you have three alternatives. What you have to do is to choose the best alternative, okay? And then you're gonna give me the answer, right? Uh, please accept the invitation. You are gonna work with your partners and try to give me um, the correct answer. You can use your cell phones for checking information in the web if you want. I'm gonna give you about, okay, seven minutes to answer the 10 questions, right? When you finish, try to write the answers in an extra piece of paper. Accept the invitation, please, and let's start working. The longest uh, tortoise. Mm -hmm. Okay. okay. Las tortugas. ¿Están de acuerdo o no? Sí, yo estoy de acuerdo. Eh, solo que para entender bien la pregunta, ¿qué significaría? ¿Qué animal vive por más tiempo? Ah, uh -huh. yeah, yeah. Those sí. are uh, those are uh, superlative questions, right? El que mm -hmm. vive okay. más tiempo, el otro es el que dice, for example, uh, the other one is the number two, uh, ¿cuál es el más alto? El número tres, ¿cuál es de este es el más pesado? Okay, like yesterday we studied mm -hmm. the superlative, mm -hmm. okay? Mm -hmm. And choose one, please. Okay, mm -hmm. okay. Go ahead. Okay, okay. thank you. The second one with okay. Ajá, más largo. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, no. Perdón, que perdí la imagen. Ahorita. Lo tres. Ajá. Which one is the tallest? La gira. La gira. Uh, the question one. The Which question one, one, the no. longest. Uh -huh. A wall. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. Number two. Which uh, one is the tallest? A giraffe. A giraffe. A giraffe. A giraffe. A giraffe. giraffe. Which which of these is the heaviest? The brain, the heart, the liver. The heaviest. Who is heaviest? Heaviest. El más pesado. Very oh. good. Ah, okay. Okay, I'm going to explain Yader. Hi Yader. Okay, welcome to the group. Thank okay, you. yeah, there in the in the WhatsApp group, yeah, there you have a, a a picture with ten questions. The questions are in superlative, okay? So you have three alternatives per question. So you have to choose the correct answer, okay? Uh, Ceci, okay. what question are you now? The number three. And the number three? Yes. Ah, oh, okay. Well, uh -huh. you can include yeah, there now, okay? Go ahead, continue working. Okay. Y la tierra. Venus y la sí. tierra. 
Venus. Venus. Ajá. Venus. 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 Ok. Marcin. A mí, a mí me sale que es Mercurio. Y antes sería Mercurio. Planet. Which Mercurio. planet is the largest? Ah, quiero ver, quiero ver. Sí, ¿verdad? Venus tiene 12.100. Más pequeño. Uh -huh. Venus. Hey, Joana en Aleida, wow. <risa> <risa> Good. Very good. In what question are you now? Five. Okay, very good. Which planet is the largest? Um, <gasps> you can consult the web if you want, okay? Okay. Júpiter, dice. No, estoy buscando. Más grande. Grande. Largest, uh -huh. más, más, más grande. Largest, ajá. Uh -huh. Más grande. Júpiter. Ok, Júpiter. Which metal is the heaviest? El más pesado. Uh -huh. Gold. Me imagino yes. que sería entre plata y, y oro. Pero no sé por. Gold, silver o aluminium? Aluminio no. <laughs> No, no, es gold. 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 So choose one, uh -huh. But which country is the driest? Uh, Egypt. 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 Which is which is closest to Ecuador. Colombia. Colombia, which is closer to the Ecuador. Colombia. And Inter. Which place is the wet, wet, wettest? Wettest. Mm -hmm. Wettest. Wait, 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 Miren, esto que he encontrado dice que lo más pesado son los aceros. Le siguen los aluminios, luego los bronces, el cobre, luego el oro, la plata, el plomo y por último pues, el... Entonces el aluminio, ¿verdad? Los aluminios. Ajá, sería el aluminio. Uh -huh. aluminio. <risa> van, ¿eh? The number seven. Is which country is the driest? Egypt. Egypt. What do you think? Igual, Egipto. Egypt. Sí, Egipto. Egypt. 
which is the closest to the Ecuador? Sí, ¿Cuál es el que está más, el más cercano a Ecuador? Uh -huh. Colombia. 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 Es. Sí. Sí, pero los demás están en, al otro lado del mundo. En otro continente. Uh -huh. Colombia. Amazing. Which place is the wettest? Más húmedo. Húmedo, ajá. Uh -huh. mm, estoy entre Hawái y Brasil. Pero Manaus, la ciudad de Hawái. Lima, Es que Brasil Manaus. creo que es húmedo por la, la parte de las Amazonas. Ajá, y ese Manaus a saber de dónde Y ese está? Manaus no sé dónde. <risa> es otro estado, creo. Sí, es una ciudad de Brasil. Las temperaturas mínimas ahí en Manaus, ama ah, pero del Amazonas. Dice que 24 grados el más bajo. Vamos a ver en Kuwait, Hawái. No sé. Kauai. Veintiún grados es la temperatura más baja de Hawái. Entonces, Hawái. Sería Hawái, Hawái, Hawái. Voy a buscar la otra, la, la, de, la de Indonesia, Bogor. Clima, Bogor. Indonesia. Treinta y un grados. Y la más baja. Hello, teacher. Hello, hello. Yeah, there. Finished? Yes, we finished. Okay, very good. Can you tell me the, the answers? Okay, for the number one, let me check the, the, the questions. Okay. Um, give me the answer for the number one, please. Whale, elephant, or tortoise? Well. Well. well, okay. The second one, I'm, I'm not going to tell you if it is uh, correct or not, because this is what we're going to do together, okay, in the, okay. the whole class. Uh, what about the tallest animal? Giraffe. Okay, giraffe. Giraffe. Giraffe, okay. Uh, which of these is the heaviest? The brain. No brain. The brain? Brain. Okay. Yeah. Which planet is the smallest? Mercury. Mercury. And the largest? Neptune. Uy. <laughs> Neptune, Neptune or Jupiter? No, Ju Jupiter. Jupiter. Okay. Largest uh, is. The largest is. El más es grande. Largo um, no, ah, Jupiter, sí. uh -huh, Jupiter. Jupiter. Okay, good. Uh, metal is the heaviest. Which metal is the heaviest? Gold. 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 Okay. Which country is the driest? Egypt. Okay. Uh, which is closest to the equator? Colombia. 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 Okay. Which place is the wettest? We are. We are not sure about. Okay, which one do you have? <laughs> Brazil. Brazil, okay. And which ocean is the deepest? The Pacific. Mm -hmm. The Pacific. Okay, 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 okay. Well, now we're gonna have, okay, we're gonna, um, we're gonna get there, okay? You have the questions and the answers, okay? Let me check the other partners, okay? Okay. That's it, good. Did you finish? Did you finish? No, no. no. no yet. Uh, what, uh, what uh, number are you now? Number nine. Number nine. Oh, okay, almost finished. Okay, one more minute, please. Hello, hello, guys. Did you finish? Yes. 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 Okay. Very good. Excellent. Let me check the other the other guys. Okay. Two groups finished and other group is still in number nine. Okay, that's it. Did you have problems okay. in, in or, or you are sure about all the answers? We are sure. Sure? Okay. We're yeah. gonna check the answers together, right? Okay. 
So we are going to we are going to close the groups. We're gonna come back to the main session. Good. Okay, now we are gonna check, okay, the answers, okay, together. Um, and then I'm gonna display the, 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 the answers, okay? So we can check if you are right or not, okay? Uh, there are 10 questions and obviously there is only uh, one correct answer, okay? One per, per, per question. Let's start, uh, let me see. Hugo, who was your partner, Hugo? Or who were your partners? Because I think you were in trios. Okay, okay. Xiomara and Beatriz. Xiomara and Beatriz. Okay, very good. Uh, Andrea Marroquín, were, no, you were in, in, in this activity, right? Yes, Ceci and Yader. Ah, Ceci and Yader, I'm sorry. Okay, so your partners, uh -huh. and uh, Aleida, right? Aleida and Joanna. That's it. So, uh, let's see. Let's start with the first one, okay? So I need uh, one person as a, uh, to represent the group, okay? Okay, for example, Andrea, can you help me to represent the group, your group? Yes, okay. Yes. So Andrea, you have to give me the answers, right? Uh, Jader, can you help me to, to represent your group? Or you are in the same group? Yes, I can. Okay, uh, you are, but you are not with Andrea, right? Yes, yes, we are. Ah, you are together. Two. Ah, okay, no, no, no. Mm -hmm. So, Andrea, you represent the group. Hugo, you represent the second group, okay? Yes. Okay, and Joanna, Joanna is here. Yes, okay, Joanna, yes. you represent the group number three, okay? Okay. That's it. So, number one, let's see. Uh, please uh, keep the, the microphone, okay, uh, on. Los que van a participar, no, no muteen el, 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 el micrófono, please. Okay. Number one, okay. Which animal lives the longest for Andrea in your group? What was the, 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 the answer? A whale. 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 Okay. Hugo. A tortoise. A tortoise. Joanna. A tortoise. A tortoise. Okay. So tortoise, tortoise, and whale. Okay. Number two. I'm going to give you the answers later on. Right now, I'm just checking the answers. Which is, uh, which one is the tallest? Okay, Andrea. A giraffe. Uh-huh. A giraffe. Uh-huh. Uh, Hugo? A giraffe. Okay, and Joanna? A giraffe. Okay, giraffe. Okay, ahí la entonación va en la A, giraffe. Okay, good. Which of these is the heaviest? Andrea? The brain. The brain, Hugo? The liver. The liver, and Joanna? The brain. The brain. Okay. Oh, so now we have different answers. Which planet is the smallest? Joanna? Um, Mercury. G uh, Hugo? Mercury. And Andrea? Mercury. Okay. Which planet is the largest? Jupiter. Jupiter, Andrea. Uh -huh. Hugo? Jupiter. And, and, and Joanna? Jupiter. Okay. Which metal is the heaviest? Joanna? Aluminium. Aluminium. Uh -huh. uh, Hugo? Aluminium. Aluminium. And what about you, Andrea? Gold. Gold. Oh my God. You have different answers. Uh -huh. Which country is the driest? Andrea? Egypt. Egypt. Joanna? Egypt. Hugo? Egypt. Okay, 
Which is closest to the equator? Joana? Colombia. Okay, Hugo? Colombia. Andrea? Colombia. Okay. Which place is the wettest? Andrea? Manaus, Brazil. In Brazil. Uh -huh. Hugo? Hawaii, Hawaii. Ah, Kuwait, Hawaii. Uh -huh. And Joanna? Hawaii, Hawaii. Okay, Kauai, Hawaii. Okay, Hugo, which ocean is the deepest? The Pacific. The Pacific, aha. Uh -huh. And you, Joanna? The Pacific. And uh, Andrea? The Pacific. The Pacific, okay. Now, I'm going to display the answers, okay? So please check, okay, the correct answers. There we go. Okay, with this part and this one. Okay, number one is not the whale, the tortoise, okay? Number two, we have here, okay, which is the number two? The liver, okay? It's not the brain, it's the liver. Jupiter is the largest, the driest, okay? And, well, the, the number two, the giraffe is the tallest, the, the, the liver, Mercury is the... The smallest, okay, the largest, eight, seven, the drier, six, is the gold, the heaviest, okay, number seven is Egypt, number eight, Colombia, everybody had this correct, okay, Kauai, Hawaii, quien dijo Brazil, okay, and the number 10 is the Pacific, okay, Andrea, how many correct points do you have, you and your group? Eight. Eight points, okay. Hugo? Nine points. Nine points, okay. And Joanna? Eight points. Eight points. Oh, Hugo's group? Ah, very good. You are the winners. I me pasa en su dirección. My mama manda pollo campeón. Okay, very nice. Así no me creen, vea. Okay. So, very nice. This is the, uh, the, the practice, okay, with superlatives. That's it, okay? Now we're going to do this exercise together. My friend Ceci, okay? Ceci, can you please help me here? Okay, we're gonna complete. We're gonna complete the the, the, the sentences. Okay, the questions in this case with uh, comparatives or superlatives. It says complete the questions from one to four with comparatives and question five to eight with superlatives. Okay, Ceci, we start with you. Number one, number two, Aleida. Number three, Beatrice. Okay. Number four, eh, Karina. That's it. Okay. Number five, we're going to ask, eh, let me see, um, Xiomara. Okay. To help me with one, two, three, four, five. Okay. Let's start, Ceci. Okay. Which country is smaller? Okay. Monaco or Vatican City? Very good. Which country is smaller? Uh huh. Very good. Number two, please. Aleida, are you there? Yes. Okay. Which one phone is highest? Comparative. Yes. Comparative. Remember, from one to four, comparative. Mm -hmm. Higher. Higher. Mm -hmm. Continue reading. Niagara Falls or Victoria Falls. Victoria Falls. Very good. Okay. In number three. Which city is crowded? Hong Kong? Or a Cairo. Okay, in this case, you have to use comparatives. Remember, from one to four, you have to use comparative. Can you repeat, please, Bea? Which city is crowded? Okay. Crowder. Okay. El, el, el adjetivo, Bea, is crowded. Ahora, crowded. ¿es largo o es corto? ¿Qué cree usted? Largo. Es largo. Entonces, con el largo, ¿qué le va a agregar cuando es comparativo? More. More, exactly. Ok, hágame la oración, please. Which city is more crowded, uh -huh. Hong Kong or Cairo? Very good, excellent. Uh -huh. Very good. Number four, please. Next participant. 
which lake is the most largest the Caspian Sea or Lake Superior? Okay, in this case, there is the number four. You have to complete it with comparative, please. Mm, the largest? Mm -hmm. Comparative. Cuando tú le pones the, the largest, ya es un superlativo, ¿ok? Entonces no me le ponga el da. Uh -huh. Which lake is? Y aquí me lo hace comparativo, ¿ok? Como el adjetivo large es corto y ya terminé en E, solo le voy a agregar una letrita. ¿Cuál es? Largest. ¿Cuál? I'm sorry, can you repeat? Es. R. La R, ajá. Larger. Mm -hmm. Can you repeat the question, please? This lake is larger. Uh -huh. The Caspian Sea? All lake superior. Superior, okay, very good. Number five, this is with superlative. Five, six, seven, and eight, we have to use superlatives. Okay, number five. Next, please. Which is highest? Mount Aconcagua, uh -huh. Mount Everest, or Mount, Mount Fuji. Ok. Tiene ganado quizás el 70%. ¿Qué le faltó para ser superlativo? Le puso la E. Uh, the highest. Excellent. Very the good. Highest. Can you repeat the question, Xiaomi, please? Which is the highest? Uh -huh. Mount Aconcagua, Mount Everest, or Mount Fuji? Fuji. Excellent. Very good. Okay. Don't forget that. Okay. okay. You want number six, please? Um, you what is long? Uh -huh. What is? What is longer? Uh -uh, uh -uh. Superlative. Remember. From five to eight, you have to use superlatives. What is the longest? Excellent. What is river. the longest? River. Mm -hmm. What is the longest river in the world? The Mekong? Mm -hmm. the, the Nile? Nile? Mm -hmm. the Amazon. Amazon. Okay, very good. Excellent. Yader, number seven. Superlative, please. Okay. Which city is most expensive? London, Tokyo, or Moscow? Okay. Una palabrita se comió. The Vamos, most. repeat. Excellent. Uh -huh. Which Can you city repeat is the, question? the most expensive? London, Tokyo, or Moscow? Or Moscow. Okay. Very, very, very good. Okay. Number eight. Okay. Uh, Andrea. What is the deep ocean in ocean. the world? Mm -hmm. The Pacific, the Atlantic, or the Arctic? Arctic, excellent. Okay, very good. What is the deepest ocean? Okay. Si se fijan, algo curioso es que cuando usted va a usar comparativos, solo van dos. Miren, Monaco or Vatican City. Niagara Falls or Victoria Falls. Hong Kong or Cairo. Si alguna vez usted va a ser superlativo y quiere preguntar, hey, ¿y cuál es la más alta? Este, este o este. So you have three options, ¿ok? So look, uh, Mount Aconcagua, Mount Everest, or Mount Fuji. This is other tip to identify the superlatives or the comparatives, ¿ok? That's it. Now, my friends, I have an exercise for you. This is a, a practice, okay, listening, a listening practice, okay? So, let's see here. Um, Hugo, can you please read the instructions from this listening practice? Okay, uh, listen to three people on a TV game show. Mm -hmm. Check the correct answer. Okay, that's it. Then you have six uh, blocks. Each block has three possible answers. So you have to listen to the question in the audio and then you have to write in your notes or in your, in your notebook or piece of paper you have with you right now, okay, the correct answer that the person gives in the 
listening, okay? For example, the number one, the Statue of Liberty, the Eiffel Tower, or the Panama Canal. Number two, uh, Niagara Falls, Angel Falls, Victoria Falls. Number three, gold butter or feathers. Feathers, in this case, is plumas, okay? Number four, the United States, China, or Canada. Number five, India, Russia, or China. And number six, Australia, Argentina, and Brazil, okay? So I'm gonna play the audio three times, and then we check the answers, right? Then you have to choose one a correct answer per block. Page 94, exercise six, listening. Game show. Listen to three people on a TV game show. Check the correct answers. Our contestants this evening are Jack, Susan, and Jonathan. And now, contestants, let's get right to our first question. Question number one. Which is the oldest? The Statue of Liberty, the Eiffel Tower, or the Panama Canal? Jack? The Statue of Liberty is the oldest. They built it in 1886. They didn't build the Eiffel Tower until 1889 and the Panama Canal until 1914. That's correct. Question number two. What is the highest waterfall in the world? Is it Niagara Falls, Angel Falls, or Victoria Falls? Susan. Angel Falls is the highest. It's over 1,000 meters high. That's right. Question number three. Which is the heaviest? A pound of gold, a pound of butter, or a pound of feathers? Jonathan. They all weigh the same. Yes. Question number four. Which country is the largest? The U.S., China, or Canada? Nobody knows? Does anybody want to guess? Jack. Uh, China is the largest. <laughs> no, sorry. Oh, shoot. Jonathan. Canada is the largest. Correct. Question number five. Which country has the largest population? India, Russia, or China? Susan. China has the largest. Very good. Question number six. Which is the smallest? Australia, Argentina, or Brazil? Susan. Argentina is the smallest of the three. That's right. Okay, contestants, the winner is... Okay, second time. Page 94, exercise six, listening, game show. Listen to three people on a TV game show. Check the correct answers. Our contestants this evening are Jack, Susan, and Jonathan. And now, contestants, let's get right to our first question. Question number one. Which is the oldest? The Statue of Liberty, the Eiffel Tower, or the Panama Canal? Jack? The Statue of Liberty is the oldest. They built it in 1886. They didn't build the Eiffel Tower until 1889 and the Panama Canal until 1914. That's correct. Question number two. What is the highest waterfall in the world? Is it Niagara Falls, Angel Falls, or Victoria Falls? Susan. Angel Falls is the highest. It's over 1,000 meters high. That's right. Question number three. Which is the heaviest? A pound of gold, a pound of butter, or a pound of feathers? Jonathan. They all weigh the same. Yes. Question number four. Which country is the largest? The U.S., China, or Canada? Nobody knows? Does anybody want to guess? Jack. Uh, China is the largest. <laughs> no, sorry. 
Oh, shoot. Jonathan. Canada is the largest. Correct. Question number five. Which country has the largest population? India, Russia, or China? Susan. China has the largest. Very good. Question number six. Which is the smallest? Australia, Argentina, or Brazil? Susan. Argentina is the smallest of the three. That's right. Okay, contestants, the winner is... Okay, guys, do you have the answers or is it necessary to play it one more time? You have the answers? Yes. yes. yes? Okay, let's see. Number one, volunteer, please, for number one. Which is the oldest? What is the answer for the number one? Liberty. Excellent, okay. The Statue of Liberty, okay, great, okay. What about the highest? Angel Falls. The Angel Falls, excellent, uh -huh. So this one, okay, very good. What about this one? Dijo, ¿cuál pesa más, okay? Which is uh, the heaviest? A pound of gold, a pound of butter, or a pound of feathers? Always the same. Always the same. Excellent. Always the same. Ok, una pregunta capciosa. ¿Cuánto pesa? Y si todo es una libra, pues, every, ok. All of them, right? The three of them. Number four, what about the, the largest? Si no me equivoco, preguntaron el, el más grande. Ok, the largest. What is the answer? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Canada, okay, very good. And the largest population? China. China. China, excellent, very good. And the smallest country? Argentina. Argentina, very good. Okay, excellent. Okay, very, very nice. Okay, great. That's it. This is, guys, is something related with superlatives, okay? Some of the exercises are taken from the platform or some other ones are new for you, okay, to practice this topic, okay? Uh, now, with the last uh, minutes that I have, okay, this is the last topic that we have for you. Uh, the last topic for this section is very easy, okay? Because I know you, you know this. This is a little conversation that I have for you to practice questions using the uh, question word, how, okay? Listen to the conversation. Page 95, exercise nine, conversation. Distances and measurements. Part A, listen and practice. I'm going to Australia next year. Aren't you from Australia, Beth? Actually, I'm from New Zealand. Oh, I didn't know that. So what's it like there? Oh, it's beautiful. There are lots of farms, and it's very mountainous. Really? How high are the mountains? Well, the highest one is Mount Cook. It's about 3,800 meters high. Wow! So how far is New Zealand from Australia? Well, I live in Auckland, and Auckland is about 2,000 kilometers from Sydney. Maybe I should visit you next year, too. Okay, this is a conversation between Scott, okay, and Beth, and they are uh, talking about one place in a specific. I want you to focus in the questions with how, okay? How high, for example. The other one is how far. And I have for you other, uh, other questions here, okay? Then we have the number one is how far, how big, how high, how deep, how long, how hot, how cold. This is like when you want to say, okay, in this case, how high y que tan alto? How long, que tan largo? Okay, how hot y como es de... In Spanish, in El Salvador, in El Salvador we say, mire como es de caliente ahí. Que tan caliente es, right? For example, Aleida is from, eh, originally from San Miguel. So one typical question for her is like, how hot? 
y San Miguel, okay? So if you see, all of them have to, okay, start with the question word how, okay? And then you have to use one adjective. Miren, si quieren decir distancia, pues usted dice how far, how far. For example, eh, let me see, Ceci. Okay. How far is your house? Eh, eh, let me see. How far is your house from La Costa del Sol? Um, I'm not sure, but um, it's about 50 kilometers. Mm -hmm. 50 kilometers, okay, very good. You see, when a person wants to know the distance, the person asks how far, okay, very good. That's it. How big, how big in this case? Y usted va a responder aquí con, con eh, metros cuadrados, etc. For example, hey, and how big is your house? Okay, how big is your house? Oh, my house is, is I don't know, it's small. It has just like, uh, three bedrooms and one bathroom, etc. Okay, or if you have a specific information like this, you can give it. Okay, this is how big, how high in this case is altura, que tan alto. Okay, how high, for example, in this case is a mountain. Okay, how high is Mount Cook? It's 3,740 meters high. Aquí, a partir de high, deep. Y long, estos tres tienen que repetirse al final. Miren este importante, ¿ok? That's it. Por ejemplo, ¿qué tan alto es el volcán de Salco? For example, this is only one example. Ya there. How high is a eh, Salco volcano? Uh, it's about... Yeah. Just make up a number. Mm -hmm. okay. How high is a Salco volcano? Ya there. Eating hundreds, uh -huh. meters deep. Okay, high. Meters high. Excellent. Uh -huh. Very good. Cada vez que le pregunten por how high, so you have to give an answer, and at the end you have to mention high. Okay? The same is how deep. Hay una canción que dice how deep is your love, right? So, but in this case, it's talking about Ok, profundidad, ok, how deep, ok, cuán profundo es el gran cañón, ok. And at the end, guys, of the answer, you have to mention the adjective deep. The same with how long, ok. Ya mi pelo con esta cuarentena, how long is your hair, teacher? Oh, it's about eh, two meters, <laughs> two meters, al final, long. Okay, two meters long. Then, que tan caliente, how hot. But in this case, you don't have to mention, okay, hot, okay. How cold, okay. In this case, you don't have to mention, okay, just in high, deep, and long. So we have these questions, guys. How far, how big, how high, how deep, how long, how hot, and how cold. Okay, that's it. So we have here five um, questions. You have the answers. So you have to tell me what the correct answer is. I need a volunteer for the number one. You choose if it is how far, how big, how high, how deep, etc. Okay, number one, the answer. Uh, Niagara Falls is 52 meters high. So what is the equation here? How high? Mm -hmm. Joanna, mm -hmm. can you repeat the, the question, please? How high is the Niagara Falls? Excellent, okay. How high is Niagara Falls? Very good. Number two, California is about, y aquí le damos esto, the square kilometers. So what is the question? Somebody Hello. else? How big? How, how long is California? How big is California? How big? How big? How big? How big? Ah, okay. Teacher, pero puede ser también long. Ah, uh ah. -uh. Porque la respuesta no. no es long, no puede ser long. Okay, so what is the question? How big, how big is California? Okay, very good. 
Number three, the Nile is 6,670 um, kilometers long. So what is oh, the long. question? How long, long the Nile is? Very good. How long is the Nile River? Uh -huh, very good. How long is the Nile River? What about number four? It says Osaka is about 400 kilometers from Tokyo. How far? Very good. Okay. How far? Uh -huh. How far is Osaka from Tokyo? Very good. Okay. And the last one is Mexico City gets up to about 28 degrees Celsius in the spring. So what is it? This is temperature. Mm -hmm. How, How hot? How? How hot? In. How hot, uh-huh, that's it, because it says go, gets up, right? Entonces sería eh, caliente, right? How hot, okay, y, eh, in this case is Mexico, okay, very good. So you see, from the answer, you can give me the correct question, that's it. This is uh, this part, okay, you have it here, that's it, you have it here in this case, this is uh, an exercise that you're gonna do. I'm gonna I'm gonna share it, okay, with you in your WhatsApp. So right now, in pairs, you can start working, okay, with your partners, and then we're gonna check the answers together, right? You have about three minutes to finish. This is very easy, okay. Accept the invitation, please. Okay, the question one is how deep? How deep? Uh -huh. The second How big is Alaska? It's how big? Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah. Any the answers? Next one is how high? How high? How high? Porque termina en high. Mm -hmm. How high? And the first. Mm. Is, uh, mm. How tall? How tall? Sí, verdad. Sí, porque está hablando de, Ajá, del de pies. Uh -huh. Ajá, la, la única que... Sí, auto. Auto. Pero me gusta distancia. Four feet high. Deep long. Me faltaba una. Uh -huh. Creo que hace falta uno. No. Está una de más ahí. Ya tenemos la respuesta. Sí, ya tenemos. ¿Cómo era la cuatro, hija? How tall. How tall. Okay, finish, guys. Yes. Yes. Okay. Very yes. good. We're gonna come back to the main session and. We finish the class there, okay? Because we're going to check the answers. Okay, okay. thanks.
Okay, guys, now we're going to check. Well, the number one is an example, right? How deep is Lake Baikal? So the answer is it's 1,642 meters. Okay. Uh, what about the number two? Volunteer, please, for the second question. How high is Alaska? How high is Alaska? Okay. How high is Alaska? Let's see. Uh, everybody is uh, in agreement? No. 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 What is the answer? How big? How big? Si se acuerdan, al final de la pregunta, al de la respuesta, perdón, tiene que decir high para que sea how high. Okay, how big, perdón. Okay, in this case, how high, eh, perdón, how high is the question and you have to answer with high, okay? So in this case, como no vemos high ahí, decimos how big is Alaska. Ha, very good. Number three, other volunteer, hoy oh, sí dice high, mire. So what is the how question? High. How high? How high is Mount McKinley? Uh -huh, mm -hmm. How high is Mount so McKinley? That's it. And number four. How tall? How, how is the CN Tower? Tall tall. Is the CN Tower. Okay, very good. It is mm -hmm. 500 meters tall. Okay, because it's a tall. Very, very nice. Okay, that's it. Those are the questions, guys, with how. Okay, how tall, how big, how far, how hot, how cold. If you want to refer to different for distances, for the weather, okay, temperatures, okay, length, depth, etc., etc. Okay, well, this is a uh, today is, is Thursday, right? If I'm not wrong, yes, okay. Uh, so tomorrow there is no class, okay? Other opportunity for finishing the sections. Remember, next week is the last week of classes, okay? This has been so fast, okay? Uh, and so today with this topic, we are wrapping, okay, section number four. Next week, we are going to start section number five, okay? So once again, the invitation to finish, to complete the exercises of the platform. Remember, this is the principal requirement to be enrolled for the next module, okay? Uh, Hugo, Tenía un problema, creo también alguien más me escribió ahora. So, I could help, ok, eh, no, Hugo, no, perdón, Omar, ok. I could help Omar, ok, for doing the exercises. And if you have any questions related to the platform, I'm here to help you out, ok. Have a wonderful weekend, enjoy it as much as possible, ok. And I will see you on Monday, ok. Thank you very much okay. for joining the class. Good night, everybody. Bye, teacher. Eat pupusas, okay? Goodbye. Okay. <laughs> Bye. Goodbye. Bye.